Dearly beloved friends, welcome back to our series on Seeking God in the Morning. Today, we are delving into a topic that touches every aspect of our lives. Love and Kindness Our scripture for today is 1 Corinthians 13 verses 4 to 7, which describes the characteristics of love. Love is patient, love is kind. It does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. This passage is often read at weddings, but its application goes far beyond romantic relationships. It describes the kind of love that should characterize all of our interactions with others. Let's break it down. First, love is patient. Patience is the ability to tolerate delay, trouble, or suffering without getting angry or upset. It means bearing with one another, even when it's difficult. It means being slow to anger and quick to forgive. Next, love is kind. Kindness is the quality of being friendly, generous, and considerate. It means showing compassion and generosity to others, even when it's not reciprocated. Love does not envy. Envy is the feeling of discontent or covetousness with regard to another's advantages, success, or possessions. Love, on the other hand, rejoices in the success and blessings of others. Love does not boast and is not proud. Boasting is talking with excessive pride and self-satisfaction about one's achievements, possessions, or abilities. Pride is an excessive view of oneself without regard for others. Love, however, is humble and considers others as better than oneself. Love does not dishonor others and is not self-seeking. Dishonoring others means treating them with disrespect, while being self-seeking means putting one's own interests above those of others. Love, however, treats others with respect and seeks their well-being above its own. Love is not easily angered and keeps no record of wrongs. Being easily angered means having a quick temper and being easily provoked. Keeping a record of wrongs means holding on to grudges and resentments. Love, however, is slow to anger and quick to forgive. Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. Delighting in evil means taking pleasure in the misfortune of others, while rejoicing with the truth means celebrating what is right and good. Finally, love always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Protecting means keeping safe from harm. Trusting means having confidence in someone or something. Hoping means expecting with confidence. Persevering means persisting in spite of difficulties, obstacles, or discouragement. Now, let's talk about the application of this scripture in our daily lives. Love and kindness are not just feelings, they are actions. They are choices we make every day in our interactions with others. It means choosing to be patient, even when we're frustrated. It means choosing to be kind, even when we're treated poorly. It means choosing to rejoice with the truth, even when it's difficult. It means choosing to protect, trust, hope, and persevere, even when it's hard. In a world that often values self-interest above all else, choosing love and kindness can be counter-cultural. It's not always easy, but it is always worth it. Love and kindness have the power to transform our relationships, our communities, and our world. Now let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for your perfect love and kindness towards us. Help us to love and be kind to others as you have loved and been kind to us. Give us the patience to bear with one another, the humility to put others above ourselves, 
and the perseverance to love and be kind, even when it's hard. Thank you for your never-ending love and kindness. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining us today. May your day be filled with love and kindness. If this message resonated with you, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel for more inspiration and encouragement. Remember, love is not just a feeling, it is a choice. See you in the next video.